What is that behind you? What do you mean, what's that behind me? Do you know what you mean? Hi everybody, welcome back to another video and thank you for being here. You've already seen a, a, bit, of, a bit of a the title uh, or the thumbnail, you have an idea, today we're playing a horror game. Uh, this one's called XP, that's short for experience, war trauma, in which you get to experience the life of a, just a post-traumatic life of a, of, a, of, a, of a World War II soldier, I've been led to believe. I saw this game uh, only an hour ago on YouTube and I was blown away by the graphics. This game is actually free. It's a free playable demo, so you can just go ahead and just skip this whole video and just leave a dislike, but in any other case, that's exactly what I'm going to be doing for the next, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes. So with that said, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, let's see what this thing's about everybody, let's go. Don't mess with this shit, it could be traumatic. Holy shit, it's, it's heavy. The game's heavy, and I got a beefy PC. Two. Oh. That's the guy moving, I'm not even touching anything. He's, he's like a bit. I don't know. Is it... Nice. I was wondering when the music is gonna come on. A oh, flashlight. It's a bummer, but it's probably gonna get fixed too. The texture quality of this thing. Older men declare war, but it's youth that must fight and die. Well, that's true. Bruh, it's realistic. It's real. It's really. It's f it's fucking photorealistic. As fuck. This reminds me of, oh, it's great, great, oh, the noise, the sound on that. Military service is a risk factor for developing PTSD. Around 78% of people exposed to combat do not develop PTSD. In about 25% of military personnel who develop PTSD, its appearance is delayed. Shit, well... That's just fucking sad. Dude, war is. This, dude. Bruh. What the hell is that, man? Are those baby rats? Jesus. Is this the man's house? Dude, fucking you. Ah. Oh. Whew. There. Guys, do you see that shit? The the visual is a bit. Oh, every time I get one of these uh, circle circles of music, I can actually interact with it. Can I turn on the TV? Jesus Christ, I always said shit. Nice, I can crouch too. Dude, what the hell is this? This is, this is a... No, the, I get it. This is... Wow. Bro, look at that. Look at that. It's almost as as real as it as as a game can be. Do you see that? Do you see the texture on the thing? How it just blurs and makes it feel like it's, it's a movie? Yeah, right. Mm, pizzas. Dude, what the hell? Yeah, this is it. 
I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. <laughs> Something I said before, while I was playing another horror game the other day, I fucking hate it when there's a when you're playing a game and there's like a bunch of cabinets and fucking drawers and you open them you can interact with them, right? And then there's nothing in them. That's just it's you know what I mean? It's a waste of time, is what I mean. Alright. Let me just go back for a second. Jesus Christ, man. Fucking not cool, man. What did I go back to the beginning? Oh, okay. Nothing here. All wars are civil wars because all men are brothers. Yeah. This is like David Lynch shit. Man. It's almost like a rendered, uh, like a GIF. That's not animation. Or is it? I don't know, because it looks crazy. What is this even, by the way? Hole in this fucking floor with bugs around it? PTSD symptoms may result when a traumatic event causes an overreactive adrenaline response, which creates deep neurological patterns in the brain. These patterns oh. can persist long after the event that triggered the fear, making an individual hyper-responsive to future fearful situations. Man, that's scary what, he, what he's describing. It is re Like, when you hear it, it's nothing. It doesn't make you feel anything. But when you experience some shit like that, it's really scary when you see it at up close. Trust me. It's like it's worse than death, dude. Why, am I, why do I sound excited about this shit? What am I doing here now? Dude, this, I can hear warn. Ah, oh, shit. Your head. Kriga, you have no idea what's going to happen to her. This way, it'll be quick. Oh, that's war. Ah, oh, shit, man. This is kill five innocent people. That's what exactly what it. Is that what it meant? Stop it! Where's the noise coming from? It's in the hole. Hello. The door's open again. Uh, should I go that way? Let me just try this. Because the last time I went this way, uh, it, it was like a progress. Yeah, this is exactly this. You know what? This reminds me of Silent Hill 4. Every time you came back inside the house, something was new happening. Man, guys, what is this fucking visuals? Look at that, it's almost more real than the eyes can see. Am I crazy? Shit, the hole just got bigger. Crap. The high levels of stress hormones secreted suppress hypothalamic activity that may be a major factor towards the development of PTSD. Shit. So PTSD actually comes when something really traumatic changes your brain's wiring? Is that what it is? Damn it, man. Yeah, it looks fucking... That, that's, that's so scary. If I see shit like that, I'll just... <laughs> I'm so easy to get. Jesus Christ. But then there's a... I can never dodge a... Jump scare. I just closed both windows and I'm still hearing uh, a lot of wind. What the frack? Anything on the roof? Oh. So I just turned. Uh, damn it. 
Yeah, we're, we're gonna go this way. Oh, wait a second. Maybe I should. Damn it. Fuck. I can't imagine for the life of me if this was real. If somebody really go through such a thing, why don't they just. If, if somebody actually goes through something like that, if it was me. I don't know, man. I would just probably... What I wanted to say is that a lot of people will probably kill themselves in such a situation. But... I know it sounds like... Stupid to say so, but I think if it was me, I would just chill to just try to cope with this thing. You know, as long as you're alive, dude, just... What is this fucking noise, man? Dude, what the fuck is that, man? Holy shit. Damn. That looks scary. Never opened this door. Did I mention that this is actually the first episode of a series? I read that on the Steam page. Is that, that's exactly what it said. And, uh... As it is the case with most horror games, most serial horror games, they come up with a free episode at the beginning so that they can, you know, uh, make some noise. Anything? Uh... I'm gonna go back. It's closed. All right. Jesus Christ, man. Shit. Dude, this looks fucked up, but it's creative. I like it. I'm not, I'm not supposed to say that shit, right? But it's really creative. It's fucking amazing. Just think of it. If you'd see something like that, you'd just lose your shit. Oh, this one's open. What the hell, man? What's with the eyes? I don't get, I don't get it. Is it the eyes of the people I killed watching me? Fuck, there's eyes everywhere now. This thing sounds like a dog. Uh, how about I... Uh, what's the, uh, the ticking? Okay, I just found an eye. Maybe I'm supposed to look for more? There's one here. There's one here. There is gonna be... Okay. Nice. There's one here. There's one here. There's four. Five. Is that it? Six. Seven. Holy shit! Dude, I just picked seven! Damn it! What the hell? I don't see anymore! Bruh! That, that's eight. Where's the last nine? Oh! Fuck, what happened? Fuck, that was intense. Okay. Let's pick him up. Alright. There's a timer again. Dopamine levels 
when a person with PTSD can contribute to symptoms. Right, let's start off with uh, 10. 11. 12. 13. Excuse me, how many? Right, 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 right. That was it. Uh, right, the door's still locked. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go back just so that the story goes further. Imagination is the only weapon in the war against reality. What the hell is just happening here, bruh? Why is everything backwards? Upside down. What the fuck, dude? Damn. It's just starting to look like a bunker now. Dude, all I'm hearing is just guts. For the past 30 minutes. The fridge is full of... Human. No, you fucking idiot! It wasn't supposed to do this! You fucked everything up! Look at the shit you did! Fuck! Now he's coming for you! What? What's fucking coming? Open your fucking door, Krieger! Open your fucking door, Krieger! Dude, what did this guy fucking do? I thought he just killed some people. Dude, the noises is just so realistic. I... Fuck, thank god I could escape. Shit, hold. Oh, I'll throw him the fuck away. Alright. How many more times should I do this? Alright, no more, no more apparently, that's it. Did I go upwards? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Fucking, come on, man. Alright. What is that behind you? Alright. Okay, both doors closed. What do you mean, what's that behind me? Do you know what you mean? Jesus Christ, man. Fuck, I'm starting to sweat. God damn it. Thank you, please, can this end, can this fucking game just end now? Right, right mouse? Oh, just getting, getting bigger. All right, all right, there's a timer. Okay, open everything to fuck up. What the hell? Alright, run. I'm going this way. Finally. Oh, I love this music, guys. Dun, 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 dun. Why, does it, why does it end so quickly? Okay, okay. Countdown. Alright. Uh, okay, well, just, just fuck that, let's just... You left the door open. For it to come in. <laughs> ah, come on, fuck! You mean I should leave it, close the door? Bruh, this game's fucking really scary. Yeah, come on. Fuck, I'm glad the timer's on. Off. Thank God. Jesus Christ, what is that?
What is that? What the fuck, dude? Is wrong with the guy who made this game? <laughs> Damn it! You're not supposed to fucking play this game if you've got a whatever something just just a condition. Oh no! It's fucking floating! Ah oh, fuck! Don't turn around! Fuck, it's turning around! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Don't fucking turn around! Ah, fuck! Dude, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! It's, it was a war, I was supposed to kill them. Fuck, dude. Open the door. <laughs> no, Craig, I'm fucking open the door. Haha. <laughs> nice. You know what? This was a really good game. The music was all right, too. By far, after about six or seven horror games I played, indie games, by the way, this was definitely the best one. Definitely the best one. <laughs> Dude, good looking game. Great job. Fucking great job. Well played. Well done. Well done. GG. If I were to rate this game overall to the music, to the just gameplay, to everything, to be fair, I would give it an 8.5 out of 10. Well job, guys. Well done. Well done. You know what? I'm, I'm genuinely surprised by the game and I'm really looking for... I'm not lying. I'm really looking forward to see where this game goes. And in the, I'm, I'm definitely supporting the game. Yeah, I don't really have anything else to add. I'm almost speechless. And uh, I just want to thank you guys for making the game. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And I'll see you guys again pretty soon. In the meantime, take care, everybody. Peace.